Hey guys, it's Dave and welcome to Injustice Gods Among Us year 3, chapter number 13. So here we go with the really crazy issue and we are hoping that everything is fixed. Superman is dreaming about I don't know why he just started dreaming, but it's already started because so I'm gonna I'm gonna read the review from comicvine.com and that time you can enjoy this comics review. We all know what caused Superman to distract drastically change who he is and what he stands for, but what would happen if that critical moment played out differently? The good things about this one is very interesting that Tom Taylor is concluding his time on the digital series What uh, What If, look at what is basically already a what if. So I am very optimistic to see how Taylor handles the second part while also saying goodbye to year 3 that won't be an easy fate but he is more than earned my fate over the years now i'm sure the chapter's big place on intentional poon i swear i will upset some of you but it's important to keep in mind this is all taking place in kal-el's head even though the moment that started it all has been changed superman would still want to see joker die and we don't know how much of current superman is influencing this would Clark have acted the same way if Bruce in a bad suit wasn't in his way. Honestly, I'm not sure, but I'm leaning towards no since the situation has been so drastically altered. It doesn't change the fact that deep down he would still want to see the clown prince of crime dead for his this. He likely wouldn't follow though. But the desire would be natural and this was an interesting way of having Clark still get what he wants. After all this, that Superman has done and just how far he has gone, you can't help but feel your heart warm just a bit as he finally gets to hold Louis on last time. There's a lot I could praise about Bruno Rodando, Juan Albaran, Zeramin Co and Rex Locus from shedding his face at just the right moments to the colorful yet not too bright appearance to his huge variety of believable and lively expressions. This villain was without question the most eye-catching part of this chapter. So Greg Katzman have given a really nice review about this one. So some and few bad things about this issue is I can and it's a minor criticism because I do love this what if look at this alternate universe but with so many great things going on in the present like the new dead man Constantine's role and the new specters that is really really different so verdict about this one that is but visiting the universe's biggest moment and putting a spin on it will have your mind racing with all of the possibilities and joker's dialogue is a twisted delight this may be a weekly digital series but that didn't stop the art team from making sure your eyes are satisfied so hope you guys have enjoyed this one is really pre Christmas and tomorrow is Christmas. Hope you guys will enjoy and celebrate the Christmas. Happy Christmas in advance. Next, the dream goes on and this is coming on next week. And after this one, I'm gonna do Batman Robin Rises. It's already done, so Robin Rises Alpha. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Just by this issue.